Hold still. I'll make this quick. We're done. Hold still. I'll make this quick. All right, who's next? Let's go. There are too many. We're done. Get ready. I'm taking you down. All right, all right. Who's next? Hey, that's... I remember when Estelle ate that Nia fruit. Well, that was quite a face she made. Oh, come to think of it, it's been a long time since we've been on our own, huh, pal? I haven't been feeling like myself, even when I'm fighting. It's like I'm tired all of a sudden. You mind keeping an eye out for a while, Repeat? Yuri, you... Huh? Idiot! Huh? What the... What? Carol? You brain-dead piece of crap! Hey, hold on a sec! You trying to be some stupid lone wolf or something? Lone wolf? Wait, I... Save the excuses for later. Huh? For now, you can drop dead. Such excitement. Hey there, sunshine. Still living? Maybe. Well, it looks like you're awake now. How nice. Jeez, Repeat. What happened to keeping a lookout? He led us right to you, like a good boy. He's pretty clever, you know. Yeah, he told us if we came this way, we'd see the biggest fool in the world. Do you guys know what's going on? Do you really understand what has to happen after this? You're the one who doesn't understand! Carol... You can't... This is one thing you can't just do on your own, Yuri! What were you trying to prove? How far did you think you'd get without us? Yuri, even if you leave us behind thinking you don't need us, we're still gonna search the whole world from top to bottom until we find you. What it boils down to is, it's no fair keeping all the fun and glory to yourself. Would it hurt for you to believe in us a little bit more? We believe in you, Yuri! Yeah! I mean, we're your friends! You got me, guys. All right, then. We're all in this together. Until the end. Aye! Right! Um, duh! So let's go do this thing! The way out of the forest is right over there. I wonder if the world will benefit if Prince Yoder becomes Emperor. Who knows? What kind of weak answer is that? I thought you'd be at least a little optimistic. Well, he'll have Flynn around. That should help things a little. But only a little? I'm not so wide-eyed and innocent to think that major change is going to happen overnight. 
That sounds like you all right. was easy. Stopping here? I heard the knights were gathering at Dadon Hold. Flynn, right? But this place is completely deserted. Looks like we missed him. I wonder if he's headed to the capital. Then we might run into him on the way. Ugh, whatever. If we're done here, can we hurry up and get moving already? Yes, ma'am. Seems you were not able to stop her. What are you talking about? We're just getting warmed up. You just sit and watch like a good boy. Yuri, don't be rude. He lent us the sword. Yeah, you're right. Why? Hmm? Why what? Why do you smile at a time like this? I'm just a wild and carefree kind of guy. Foolishness. <laughs> Can't help it, I guess. I was born like this. Let's go. We can tell. Mm -hmm. On the outside, he might not get angry or flustered or cry, but we can tell. And right now, he's so frustrated it's all he can do not to scream. But Yuri keeps all that hidden away, so it looks like there's nothing wrong. And for me, now, when I see no hope at all, his attitude is why I can still stand up and fight. <sighs> Carol, what's the holdup? I'm coming! Why are you telling me this? Yeah, you're right. Someday I'll tell him myself. Someday. True friendship. However, the time will come when hope turns to despair. If it isn't the Imperial Knights, I guess they're getting ready to invade the capital. But it looks like they're at a standstill. I wonder if something's wrong. Oh yeah. Yuri, wouldn't it be great if Flynn came with us? Did you forget that he's leading the Knights? I really doubt there's any way he could come with us. 
As soon as the scouts return, gather all of the lieutenants. Yuri! Everyone! Thank goodness you're all right. Her Highness must still be in Zophius, then. Yeah, for now at least. What are you doing out here? The Royal Guard has taken up their positions ahead. We're just waiting on the scouts I sent to observe the enemy forces. Captain, you don't have the time to be speaking with... No need to worry. We don't plan on staying long. You're going to the capital, too? Yes. There's something I'd like to discuss alone with you. Do you mind? Captain! It's fine. I'll be back soon. If there are any movements, be sure to notify me. Let's go. Prince Yoder informed me of what's been going on. About Lady Esteliz's powers, too. If it really comes down to it, you might have to... Hey, the whole reason we're going to the capital is to prevent that from happening. I know that. I'm only talking about the worst-case scenario. I've already made my choice. Or have you forgotten? No. I remember. I'm prepared for the worst, but I'm going in the hope that it can be avoided. What are you going to do? I've been thinking about this for a long time now. What is a law? What is a crime? Where is the line between right and wrong? After much consideration, I came to the undeniable conclusion that such a clear distinction cannot be made. Even now, my belief that we all need laws hasn't changed. But, even so, I cannot bring myself to call you evil. That's why I hoped that we could make a world where we wouldn't have to keep repeating the same mistakes. Yet look at what's happening now. Then why not come with us? The capital's full of air, so your knights wouldn't be able to enter. But if you come with us, even if we can't get everyone through, we might be able to manage some of them. Dang Nomos, huh? Honestly, I don't know what's going to happen from here on out, so you're going to have to decide for yourself what to do. I... Excuse me, sir. A large group of battle machines has emerged from the enemy lines. The numbers are staggering. What? <sighs> Trouble! How could they have been hiding so many of their forces? It looks like we're going to have some difficulty breaking through that. Some? Oh no, that's gonna be brutal. By the time we get to the capital, we'll already be half dead. It's not like we have to face those things head on. Patty, do you see any way around them? Hmm, there's nothing but enemies anywhere I look. I have a feeling it might be impossible. But we're so close to the capital. They've started to move. They're coming this way. Hey, shouldn't we withdraw back to the hold? Captain. Yuri, are you going to the capital to stop Alexei? And to save Her Highness? Yeah. Then... No matter how this ends, I believe that what you've decided is the best possible outcome. Flynn. You should go. Knights! An enemy battalion stands before us, and Alexei lies in wait behind them. I won't tell you this will be easy, and I understand if you want to flee. But I want you to remember what it is that we must do. What it is that we're protecting. We're knights. With our swords, we protect the people. I will not force any of you to fight. But if you share the same spirit as I do, then let us fight this battle together! Flynn really is amazing! Imperial Knights, straight ahead! Let's head for the capital. <sighs> a double sigh? Knock it off. We have to make up our minds about Estelle. <gasps> 
From what people who fled from the capital said, it's probably already too late. Stop it! Don't say that! I think Yuri has decided where he stands already. How would you know that? You mean, the reason he tried to go alone was... We have to make up our minds, too. I know what we have to do, but still... Capital. This is so horrible! The plants are all overgrown. It's gotta be the air. It's so dense. Too much of this stuff would kill anybody. We'd definitely be in trouble without that sword. Yeah, stick close to me. Especially you, old man. Hey, I've been on pins and needles since we got here. Hold my hand, would you? Give me a break. Hold my hand! I'm not letting you run away anymore, Yuri! Give it a rest. I'm not going off by myself anymore. Look! Monsters got in here! How? The barrier is back up and running fine! They look like they're going crazy, like the ones we saw back at Cave Mock. Yuri, what is it? Huh? Oh, it's nothing. Let's go. We can't keep Estelle waiting. Hmm? The lower quarter's at the bottom of that slope. It's his home. It's... It looks like it's been overrun by the plants. <sighs> We'll destroy them in no time! Destroy them! <laughs> What's up, old man? I want to hear what you're planning. You know, about Estelle. <sighs> We're all floating in the same boat, right? Care to share? I'm not sure I won't lose my nerve if I start talking about it now. You're just gonna have to bear with me till the time comes. You're prepared to do what's necessary. But you haven't given up hope. That about sums it up. I guess that's your style. But don't try to take it all on by yourself, alright? <laughs> it's weird hearing kind words from you, Raven. <laughs> True enough. This enemy doesn't look so nice. Get ready for anything. side. Hey, 
We're out of time. Why don't we just blow it open? Just because there's nobody out here doesn't mean nobody's in there. It'd be a pain if we were discovered. The air is all over the city, isn't it? It's gotta be in the castle, too. Alexei must have taken some sort of precautions against that. Oh! Carol did it! Got it! Everybody hurry! Good work. Okay, this is it, folks. The capital's like this, and Estelle's power's been released. The world might be done for. Oh, the gloom. Rita, darling, how can you be so gloomy? Okay, first, never call me darling. Second, excuse me for not being as optimistic as you. Hey now, old Raven's not without his own worries. Oh, really? Sure, but what's the point of getting all down? We're doing all we can to make this work out, right? You just gotta believe in yourself. Wait, that's basically a Rita trademark, ain't it? Okay, fine, you're right. Oh, how could I let you outsmart me? There now, there's hope for the world yet. As long as our little genius doesn't lose that attitude. Huh? There's no air in here. He must have figured out how to use Estelle's power to do this. It may have been that the outer barrier was to keep the air in. That hunch you had is looking more likely by the minute, old man. We're gonna have company before long. Why is it I'm only ever right about the bad stuff happening? If you only think negatively, only bad stuff's going to happen. So just think positively. Well said. I'm sure you're right about that. Hmm. I've always thought of myself as an optimist, to be honest. It's not like saying that now's gonna change anything. We gotta brace ourselves and push forward. Yeah, those bogus knights who've sided up with the bad guys don't stand a chance. I. It's too bad in a way. I finally get to see the castle, but not for the reason I was hoping. Flynn entrusted Estelle to you, right? Yeah. He's taken on his own share of burdens, so we can focus on rescuing Estelle. Still, it must be hard for you. I'll carry his resolve with me. Good. I'm sure we can save Estelle then. <laughs> Hold on. Someone's there. Ha! Huh? What the? Yuri? Oh, it's Yuri! Huh? Hanks? Thanks, everyone. You're all okay. Hey, that's my line. Why are you inside the castle? Yeah, you all too. Yes, well, Sir Flynn ordered me to lead the evacuation of the citizens. However, I realized that the inhabitants of the lower quarter were nowhere to be found. It wasn't part of my orders, but uh, you see... The exit collapsed and a strange fog covered the ground. We were in quite a fix. Oh, thanks to these knights, we escaped the fog and came here. They saved our lives. I... I am prepared to receive punishment for violating my orders. I say, we will, we take, will the take the same, the same punishment. punishment. Punishment? I'm just an old man, boys. Anyway, isn't it the duty of the knights to protect the citizens? You did well. Th this is an honor. Captain Schwa... Captain Raven. Don't call me Captain. I'm just Raven. Sir, I apologize, Sir Just Raven. Looks like somebody respects you. 
I never would have believed it. Guess you can't judge a book by its cover. This is great, Yuri. <laughs> I forgot how tough everyone was. What was I worried about? I don't know why, Yuri, but you look happier than I've ever seen you before. Yeah, she's right. Did you see the former Commandant? Sir, no sir, but we overheard the Royal Guard outside. Something about the sword stair? The sword stair? That really tall thing we got blasted off of. So that means he's still up there. Sounds like Smoke and Scoundrels both like high places. The problem is only important people can get to the sword stair. There's some special mechanism. I can take care of locks. Rita can take care of formulas. We can do it. You said it. Hanks, all of you should stay here and hide. Let's go. Isn't this great? Now everyone in the lower quarter is safe. Yeah, now all that's left is crushing Alexei and saving Estelle. You must be so proud that your men are finally doing some actual work. I've tried to tell you, I don't have any men. There was a real sparkle in their eyes when they were looking at you, old man. How can someone respected by so many be so cold to his friends? All right, Raven's starting to think he's had about enough of these shenanigans. Thank you. 